Good morning. For me, it's like 6 a.m. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna teach you guys how I set up to paint, what I do, and all that. Let me age my mustache real quick. So before I paint every morning, like the day I'm gonna paint, what I do is I get 91% rubbing alcohol. Get the Ido, get one of these, you know, or the uh, microwavable oatmeals. What I'm going to do is you put 97% rubbing alcohol in, just a little bit. Get your brushes. So, you do not, for like when you're a newbie and like not professional painting and all of that, go to Hobby Lobby or Michaels and get these ones, the clear coated ones. Because let me tell you something, these are going to get used, they're going to get old, they're going to start fraying. You're gonna have to do like a little snip snip here and there. So until you're actually comfortable with painting, taking care of your, uh, your brushes and all of that, don't buy the Citadel ones. There's nothing wrong with them. It's just, you know, you wouldn't buy a Mustang unless you truly knew how to drive stick shift. I'm talking like the 60s Mustangs. Like you wouldn't just buy a really fancy car and then all of a sudden, you know, trial and error it with a $70,000 car, like, so no. So what I'm gonna teach you is you're gonna do this, dip, dip, the camera wants to focus. Don't do it harsh, and what I want you to do is kind of push it against the wall. You're probably gonna have to hold it and twist. You see how some stuff comes out? Especially with your contrast, sometimes you don't get everything out. Do not leave them sitting in the bucket you know, don't let them, don't, don't do that because you will, you'll ruin the shape. So dip that a couple times. You'll watch the paint come out in here. I hate Mountain Dew, but today I didn't have anything else to drink because I'm an NPC competitor, guys. I don't, I don't mess with that stuff. I really don't. But you know what? Once or twice, like a year is not a bad thing. So what you're going to do is you'll let those just dry out clean all your brushes then always have something laid down like cardboard because you never know if the paint is going to be like i don't know there's so many things that can go wrong so just cover then what you do is take these guys i always leave it on my knee that way it's out of the way and it's right there so whenever you're done say you're drying off what you're getting see how that just comes right out to 97 percent you could use other percentages it's not a big deal it's just with the 97 percent it's uh it's gonna clean it off like nothing and then what i'm gonna do is in my next video i will actually teach you guys how to paint this was just a setup video so you don't need a fancy paint dipper you don't need uh, to go out and spend $10, $12, $8, whatever the prices are for most of those. You just need an old microwavable mashed potato container. I'm pretty sure the oatmeal containers will work too. I mean, if you want to, honestly, you could take this can. If you're an adult, don't do this when you're a kid. Um, you could do something with that and make your own reusable paint can you know like not that big of a deal uh keep a little bit of curved scissors with you just in case because some of these brushes have hair so some of these brushes will have extra hair on them like one hair will just be going all the way out like it's just not even the, the right size so just snip those let those dry and i'll come back to you guys later and i'll teach you guys how to paint